Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I thought I would share with you our nighttime routine in our new house since I haven't done that yet. And I'm right here with the girlies. They are eating pasta tonight, a little messy. But yeah, if you guys have missed any of my previous vlogs, make sure to check them out. Also subscribe if you guys haven't. And I just thought I would do a mama pamper routine today and then just share with you guys what we've been doing uh, just to relax at night and wind down what I've been watching on Netflix and just skincare products that I have been loving. Uh, so of course, vlog style, your favorite. So I hope you enjoyed today's video and let's roll right in. Yummy, yummy, yummy. <laughs> and we had to take their little dresses off because it's pasta night, isn't it? You guys like to get dirty, but you love pasta. Yeah. And we just have some Family Junior on right now, just some cartoons, and it is so sunny, so hot today, so we have the blinds down. And it's probably gonna be a really, really warm night, so you'll probably see the sun here until about 11 at night. So, yeah! Isn't that right, Max? And look at you, looking so cute with your new haircut. Daddy did such a good job on you, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. And I get asked a lot what uh, Maxie is. He's a Marky. He's a little Marky. Um, nom, nom. There's Daddy Rye, and he's actually barbecuing right now. And we're gonna have some dinner. We're gonna have some chicken tonight, and I made a salad, so I'll quickly show you guys what I made. Let's go see. It's not fully clean in here. We are in the middle of cooking, but I just got back from groceries, and I also just got back from my hair appointment, so I'm gonna tell you how that went. But first things first, yummy salads. This is what I made right here. Wow, it's awfully dark right now, my camera. Doesn't want to pick it up. There we go. So just some lettuce, cucumbers, tomatoes, carrots, all that good stuff, vegetables. I got these kebabs uh, today and look at that. They look so good. We're gonna have these for dinner tomorrow. I got steak and then chicken as well. Look how big that is. I don't even think I've ever seen kebabs this big. I also got eggs, I got some asparagus for tomorrow, some bread, milk. I got some turkey bites, which are my favorite of these. And then also watermelon. We have some sausage from yesterday. We have some tomatoes. Um, I was kind of in a rush, so I didn't organize this all properly. The girls' favorites, which are these, the nanos, and then also some of these tropical little fruit sensations. I also got peaches, which you guys, I have not had peaches in, I wanna say like two to three years. I have not had a peach in so, so long. I'm so excited, I'm gonna have one tonight. And these are my favorite little cucumbers. I've been eating cucumbers like crazy, so I just got three sets and carrots. Little Miss Mia here likes to have food fights with her sister. There's food all over the floor, my little missus. Isn't there? You guys make mommy clean, clean, clean. <laughs> Okay, so the girls are still finishing up eating and I just wanted to quickly talk to you guys about my appointment. And also, I just got TikTok. So crazy, I know, but I feel like I've been really behind in the whole social media and just getting all the new stuff. And you guys have been asking me for so long now to get a TikTok, so go follow me. It is just SL Miss Glam. I actually just posted my very first video yesterday. I just made my second today, so they're really fun actually. They're kind of addicting. But I just got back from my PRP consultation. I'm pretty sure Mia just threw her plate. <sighs> Uh, uh, I can't wait for seven o'clock when I can relax huh, and make myself a tea and some popcorn. I want to have a movie night, which, okay, I have to tell you guys this too. I have been obsessed, obsessed with the kissing booth too. I was in love with the first one, but the second one I feel like was so much better. And I think I've seen it 10 times. Like it is so good. I've made my friends watch it. Let me know if you guys have seen it. Are you guys team Marco? Uh, but, oh, Ryan's coming in from the barbecue, but I also just wanted to let you guys know about my appointment. So, um, once I kind of, well, I, I, I'm gonna see them in two weeks-ish. They're gonna do some research on my hair, which I will talk about, but uh, I did have my wig come in too, so I really wanna show you guys what it looks like, because I'm obsessed, and I took some videos today, and it just looks amazing. Definitely the best quality I have ever, ever seen. Okay, so dinner is ready. I thought I would eat really quickly before I chat with you guys. So chicken, potatoes, and salad. And this is also my favorite salad dressing right now, the olive oil. 
and it is the fig balsamic it's so good so we're gonna eat now that the girls have eaten they also have their dessert and they're eating some cheerios right now but i'm gonna enjoy some dinner so we usually eat at the dining room table but today just because we're keeping a close eye on the girls eating pasta uh, we're just eating in our kitchen so yeah but we usually do eat in our dining room which we really really like so i'll maybe get that in the next vlog okay so i just came to my closet we just finished dinner i thought i would quickly talk to you guys before uh we bathe the girls i thought completely forgot that we had to bathe them today and it's just been a really hot day so i definitely want to make sure that they have a nice bath before they go to bed uh but i wanted to quickly talk to you guys about my appointment today so my first appointment with PRP, which I was telling you guys about in my alopecia video, is another injection and uh, a type of service that you can get if you're losing hair. So I went and got a consultation and basically, and it kind of sucks because it's kind of been the response of like every doctor I've talked to, but like my spots are too big for them to inject when there's no hair follicles. So she was just saying they do it with patients that actually have hair follicle to see results. So. The other thing I said instead of trying PRP is obviously going back to the Corazone injections because they obviously worked. Like, look at that. So they worked really well. So um, one of the doc on-site doctors, I don't think she was very experienced with doing it. She said she's done it with eyebrows and like smaller, you know, areas, um, but not like a big area on the scalp. So I definitely want to look into it a little bit more. They are going to get or touch base with me in the next few weeks to see uh, what we're able to do. But basically she said if we're gonna do bigger spots it's gonna be really really painful so uh, i just yeah i mean i went through birth so i'm sure i'll be fine uh but yeah i know that it works i know that cortisone shots worked for me and the injections worked for me so i definitely want to get like a small little bit done just how we did the front parts in the other spots so that's what i'm looking on getting and i just kind of wanted to give you uh yeah, an update, I guess, on it. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited. And it's funny because since I'm filming this at like five o'clock, you guys can see that I'm tired, exhausted, and that's kind of how our nights are. So, I mean, the fact that I'm saying, you know, oh, I can't wait to relax and just, it's not that I don't want to spend time with the girls. It's that we've been with them all day and it's time for us to relax. And we get really excited at the end of the day because, I mean, we had an entire day filled with me and Sophia. So, I mean, we're definitely excited just to spend some time together, relax, watch a movie. So yeah, I just wanted to say that as well, because <laughs> who knows? I don't know what kind of feedback I'll get from such a realistic nighttime routine, because it's really funny. I prefer doing realistic vlogs over showing, you know, just all the stuff, or just, I guess, how do I, how do I say it? Like, filming it in a way that isn't realistic is just not my thing anymore. I used to do ones like that where they'd be really, I guess, cinematic and I'm not, I don't know, I'm not really into that anymore. I kind of just like making vlogs that are realistic and kind of sharing with you guys what it's actually like for me at nighttime. So once seven o'clock hits, it is my relaxation. Ryan makes his coffee, a seven o'clock espresso, and we sit on the patio. I've been watching, like I said, The Kissing Booth, and he's like, you're so into the teeny bop movies, and I totally am. I just am. I love it so much. It's such a good movie. So yeah, let me know. Are you team Marco or team Noah? I don't know. I've always been team Noah, but now I really like Marco, and I love his character, and oh, you guys, I'm obsessed. <laughs> uh, but let me know if there's any other shows on Netflix to watch. I definitely will check it out tonight to see if there is. And I am going to get down to the girls. We're going to give them a bath and then I'll go through my nighttime routine with you. And holy heavens, so beautiful. My Freedom Couture wig is right here, you guys. I actually have a picture to insert, little video so you can see what it looks like on. I am... Oh, blown away. I think it looks so natural. I think the color I chose was great, the length, and it's so lightweight. If you guys are interested, I bought this at full price. I don't have a coupon code, but if you are in need of a wig, you need to invest into Freedom Couture. I'm not joking. This is the best quality, way better than Bellamy, I have to admit. The last ones were really heavy that I had. This one's really nice and lightweight. Look at the Luxe box, too. I really like it. Okay, I'm gonna bathe the girls, and then I'll be back on here after. Seriously though, look how cute their bathroom is, you guys. I love their bathroom. So I just wanted to quickly show you a few products that I've been really liking. Burt's Bees. I don't know why I'm just starting to use their products for babies, but 
amazing like this is our favorite we've been using the bubble bath also the shampoo and wash it smells so nice and then the Burt's Bees um, toothpaste and then we have their toothbrushes in here so yeah just a really beautiful line and I love the smell like I love the smell of their products but gonna get the bathroom ready and bathe the girlies did we have a bath bath yeah we did it's almost time for Betty finish your bubbles please Look at your hair, it's getting so long. Beauty. <laughs> See, he likes it. He likes it. Good job. Good job. Oh, some water. Ah, Good job, Miss Mia. Look at you doing it all by yourself. Whoa, girl. Whoa. Okay, so the girlies are in bed now. We just brushed their teeth. It is around seven o'clock and they usually go to bed. Like we get them ready for bed by 6.30. They're in bed by seven. Uh, and our builder's actually coming here to help Ryan out with a little bit of the landscape outside, uh, some of the trees. So I'm gonna relax. I think I'm gonna go outside enjoy a little bit of sunshine and then come back in here. I wanna do my skincare and have a bath and throw on some Netflix, make some tea. I'm so excited to relax, but and you guys know I have been loving my tub so much. So I'll show you like what products I've been using and you can see in here too, this is what it looks like when we have our blinds down. So it's really, really nice. It's still really sunny, but just a little bit more relaxing. It is exactly seven o'clock. Ryan's coffee time. Okay, so I'm about to turn Netflix on. And if you guys have not seen this movie, it is so cute right here. But if you have seen it, definitely let me know in the comments and what you thought, if you liked it more than the first. But this is what I'm gonna be watching. I almost forgot, I was enjoying the movie so much, but I'm gonna make myself a tea. These have been my two favorites, so the cold 911, it's like a nice herbal tea, decaffeinated, and then the detox is also really nice, it's a green tea. I think I'm gonna go with the green tea. The other thing I cannot decide between is popcorn or watermelon. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of have a sweet tooth right now, but I kind of crave popcorn. Popcorn it is. I've not had popcorn in so long, and teeny bot movies, I have to have some popcorn. And Ryan calls it TV Bop. That's why I'm calling it TV Bop because he makes fun of me. But they're really awesome. They're movies for everybody. Doesn't matter how old you are. <laughs> By the way, you guys, these shorts have five buttons. So you may notice in some of my vlogs, I have one undone because five is a little unnecessary. And I the, like the countless times I've filmed and had to refilm it because one of my buttons was opened up too many times. This is what I'm talking about, you guys. Popcorn, I've got some tea, I've got some Netflix. <sighs>
Okay, so I just got out of the bath. A few things I wanted to do to wrap up my nighttime routine. I wanted to just show you a few products that I'm really excited to try out, plus my body lotions I've been using. And also I wanted to share with you guys what our lights look like at night, since you haven't really seen that. So I'm just gonna quickly show you. Oh my goodness, there's like hardly any left. So this is the body lotion I've been going in with, the Jergens Natural Glow. Look how little there is left, clearly I love it. And then the other one I use in the day, which has really grown on me, this right here is a dry Moroccan oil. So it's really nice, it smells really good and it just hydrates your skin and it smells amazing. So highly recommend that. The other one I've been going with, uh, in with this summer has been this and I'm almost out. I have to definitely get the full size. It's the Patrick Ta Major Glow Body Oil. It's so nice, oh my goodness, I have like hardly any left. So I definitely have to get another one of those. And I thought I would mention this too, I didn't do it today, but I do do it once a week. This is a Chanel hydrating facial mask and I really like it. My skin has been super like ultra dry here just cause the weather, so I've been literally soaking in uh, extra hydrating products. So this is honestly a really nice one. Oh, I haven't really used this actually that much, so. They actually sent a glow recipe uh, PR package to my old address. So that was really nice that they sent some stuff over. Hopefully I can get another package to come here. Uh, but this right here is really nice. It's the Watermelon Glow Toner. So I actually have always used their serum, but I'm out of it, but I'm really loving their products. They are really nice. If there's anything else you guys have been loving, let me know from Glow Recipe. And then these masks I just got in my Ipsy bag. I'm really excited to try these out. I love face masks. There's nothing like a good face mask. And then the other body cream I use is this one right down here. And I have my cleanser, I have some random hair care, I have makeup in here. This is like basically my pixie drawer, but I do love this toner that I've been using. And I also have my Tiffany & Co. Um, body lotion as well. This smells so good. I try not to use too much so I can have it <laughs> last a little bit longer, but yeah, that's what I have in there. But yeah, the skincare I've definitely been doing a lot of lately and just making sure that I'm staying super hydrated. This is amazing for my, my lips. If you guys have not tried this, this stuff is amazing. The Hangover Pillow Balm. It's so hydrating. I put it on at night. The other one that I like is Tatcha. So I have two of them and this is really nice. It's like an overnight lip treatment. Anyways, all right, so that was all my skincare, and usually the other thing that I do, I clean my makeup brushes, but I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow morning just because I am so tired. Um, I have scissors actually right here too. I was giving myself a little trim, uh, just my split ends obviously. I had to get a little chopped off, but yeah, my makeup vanity is actually very organized. I 
Usually we'll do a little bit of tidying up at night if I have time, but I am just gonna show you guys all our pretty light. Okay, so this is the perfect time because our blinds are closed. Let me show you guys this. Whoa. <laughs> This thing, you guys, is so bright. I, I don't even think you can see how bright this thing is, but it is bright. And we also have two bedside table ones as well, so I might as well show you those. That's what it looks like. It's really hard to see though because they are really bright, but that is what that looks like. Look how beautiful and bright and vibrant that is. We love our lights in our master. I know we don't have we have a missing side table still on back order but hopefully i can get it soon uh and i will show you guys the lights downstairs as well if there are any podcasts you guys have been listening to let me know because i really want to start relaxing at night and just like listening to podcasts or if there's a youtube channel you really love definitely let me know in the comments as well that's basically what i've been doing you can see my laptops on the floor so it's been something i've been doing every night just watching netflix and youtubers and just like winding down Okay, I just had to change the setting on my camera because these things are so bright, but you would have seen this um, really well in our video when we first walked through the house. So this is what it looks like. The three tiers are so pretty. I'm trying to be a little quieter because the girls are sleeping. Last thing I thought I would show you guys, and sorry, I can't show all the lights downstairs because our windows are open and they are that bright. Uh, but once I do my home tour video, I will show you guys all the lights and everything like that. But you can go to like when we first walked through the house because it was really late at night. So you can see all the lights on. Uh, Ryan's just watching some TV downstairs too. I don't want to annoy him. But this is honestly when we both relax and spend time to ourselves and obviously i'm filming right now but i definitely love to just wind down at night and just spend the hours relaxing uh but right here tom ford soleil blanc body oil i've been using this a lot and i love it i definitely want to get the full size of the light colored one and then this right here i've been burning it a little bit the peony and blush suede so um i have one in my washroom as well in uh why can i not think right now what is it called the powder room. So there's one downstairs in the powder room and also my way fra fragrance. I love this. It smells so good. This is the Melrose Place. So I've been using this a lot. I'm not done. I still have to get like some more books around the house and stuff. I have trays that uh, my friend Nicole is making for me for a ton of the areas in the house, the bonus, the kitchen, my closet, and some other stuff. So once those come in, I definitely will show you guys. This is also, oh, I can't burn it yet because it's so beautiful, but the Volupsa candles are just stunning. So beautiful. I think my coat expired, but I'll see if they can create another one because I honestly want to get some more candles. They are just so beautiful. So I am just gonna end this vlog right here, right now before bed. I do wanna relax and just watch some YouTube and hang out in bed. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my nighttime routine and I literally filmed it as I was going through my night. So it is a legitimate nighttime routine and what I do. I know it's not the most extravagant of nighttime routines, but it is realistic and it's what we've been doing. So I just thought I'd share with you a little bit and catch up, chit chat, tell you what I'm watching on Netflix. Clearly I'm obsessed with the kissing booth. It's just so good. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed watching this vlog. And of course, if you guys have not yet subscribed, I would appreciate if you subscribe, join the fam, we're growing. I'm so happy about it. And I have so many new vlogs coming coming your way so if you haven't also add me on tiktok since i'm making them regularly and i'm just having so much fun with that uh but i hope you guys have an amazing day amazing night and i will see you guys in my next video